Ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? My name is DJ A9ZT, and we're back with WWE Champions and another six star silver character gameplay preview video. And today we got Dominic Mysterio, the old DM here, the OG Dom, Big Eye Dom, uh, Little Kid Dom, Baby Dom Dom, all of the above. We're going to take a look inside his poster just to refresh it. He is percent chance for yellow gems on the initial board and charging the uh, moves of that color by two more points so absolutely vital showdown trainer and he's got the raw link the mexico link the mysterio family and the modern era if we're looking at his six star move it is the frog splash and we're not going to be using that or the reversal here so we're not even using a five star move at least not in the first set. I might try some things after this, but this is where it's at. This is the move set. I mean, I don't know. We might just talk about the other sets. If I can't get the other sets to do anything worthwhile, we're not going to run them on the video because let's be honest, this is how you run Dom. So if you run the, the Buckle Hurricane Rana here, two charge blue, you're going to deal 108,000 damage plus 53,000 bonus damage for every heal gem. And we got a one charge green Russian leg sweep that we're going to be chucking 12 random heal gems. And then we got the 619, which is only three charge green. And we're going to choose a two by two area to swap into blue. So let's get to the loadout. We got Ronda Rousey train and heal gems do 150% more damage, but it does take away two of my heal gems. We got the rock here for four more heal gems. We got Naomi coaching four two more extra heal gems and they'll give us more health when we use them and we got the one two three kid for heal gems do 15 percent more damage so that's going to affect the buckle rana and we'll get another extra heal gem from him so now we're doing 17 random heal gems and that's not it we got the la familia plate on here so whenever we break three or more blue gems we're going to get three green move points I'm running double armor on mine. You don't need gem damage or move damage, really, with this. It's all in bonus damage. So I'd run double armor or I'd run vitality. If I'm using it for faction boss, you should be just running double vitality on him to live longer. And let's watch this damage because it's actually insane. I don't hear people talking about this Dom much anymore, but if you need a dude for showdown who can get some damage out there quickly look at that so turn one 17 random heal gems now i'm not even counting like the move damage or nothing here we're just going to look at what we're doing here bonus wise he's at 14 million health and that dropped look at that 2.4 million bonus damage right there so now we get a two by two into blue and i can just do that okay boom bam that gives me my three green mp back from that plate mind you we've already done 2.4 million bonus damage this turn so we're gonna chuck out again and we're gonna do bonus damage here again watch this one from 11 million oh 4.8 million damage so that puts us up 6.8 7.2 million turn one right now 7.2 million turn one we're going to take that, get a little three match right there. Boom. We're full again. Remember, 7.2 million already done. The board's nearly full at this point. We're going to go ahead, hit it again. Boom. 5.4 million. So that's 12.6 million damage turn one. We're going to swap a two by two into blue again. All right. We're going to go ahead and go right there and we accidentally pinned him there but did, did he kick out nah the heel gem still a little broken all right but he did kick out it's okay we'll give him one turn you get the idea though you get the idea though i messed that up i had him that's like 14 million damage turn one that's crazy good right there that still will hold up that still holds up to this very day good luck against this guy <laughs> and I got the extra turn strap on him in case anything goes bad. So, wow, man. All right, let's see what else he can do. All right, so we picked up a T unit 
and we're getting back out here and we are going to try the same exact build but we're going to take the la familia plate off of there we're going to take the la familia plate off of there and i'm going in blind i don't know i ain't even fought this rocky johnson like this so i don't know what's going to happen here so i got no plate I know I'm hitting 2.4 milli here. Now you would need a little board luck. Because we can hit the blue move again. But we want to hit the green too. Would be nice if there was a green one like there. I could. And oh, there is. Look at this. Okay. So we're going to take blue. Oh, look at that. Got me some green. We'll go ahead and put the heel gems out again. Okay. No skill plate now. No skill plate now. Yeah, I'm like, why didn't another move fill up? Thought because I didn't use the plate here. Right, We're trying to do right. normal, normal Dom here. And, oh, look at that. There was a wild card, but what what can you do? Normal Dom's going to let him have a swipe. Now, one of those moves is a 10. I don't think I'm going to be ready to hit again this turn either. I just keep chucking heel gems out to cover up some of his power gems. Look at that. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You could break his last one. Uh, what I want to do. I was looking for anywhere where like two are in the vicinity. I mean, I could do that. Look at that. There we go. And just like that, ladies and gentlemen, Acro Dom has destroyed without the La Familia plate here. And we're just going to go ahead and hit the 619 for good measure because that's what we want to do. And boom. Still very good with no skill plate. So that's what I'm saying. So just looking over the rest of his moves, you could easily run the double red here. You could choose four columns to make into reinforce. You could get a 3x3 three three random area into blue. Hopefully it hits some of those. Maybe that'll double it up, right? And then you can hit this diving crossbody. Choose a 4x6 to swap to red. That refills those. That's the recycle era right there, okay? That'll work. You can put your 12k damages on there. But realistically, that is not hitting for nearly enough damage to keep up. Uh, we have a reversal. So you could be annoying and put the reversal move on your defense. You could use it. And maybe some weird stipulation kind of match. I don't know. That are some big numbers on there. You might be able to find a use for that eventually. I don't know why you would. Frog Splash. Increase your blue gem damage by 95% for two turns. That sounds pretty enticing, honestly. But the reality is you're only swapping a 3x3 three three area into blue gem. So it's only 9 gems getting that boost. Maybe you catch a couple outside of it. Maybe you get 12 to 15 blue gems if you're real lucky in your cascade. But I don't know. I just can't see that coming anywhere even close to the radar of this. So if you're watching this video, you already know that these movesets aren't it. You know what I mean? So if you're watching this video, you're taking him to 6 star. And this is what you came for. So that's what you got. And I'm just going to leave it at that. Until next time, y'all.